Hey y'all, I am Luna Ray and I'm here to do a collective reading. We're going to do an earth sign reading, Capricorn towards Virgo. Before I get into the reading, can you please like, share, and subscribe to my channel? Can you follow me on Instagram at I am underscore just in the poll? Everything will be down in the description box below this reading. So let's jump into it. Spirit, what messages do you have for Capricorn towards Virgo for this collective read? Earth sign reading. Spirit, what messages do you have for Capricorn towards Virgo for this earth sign reading? What messages do you have for Capricorn towards Virgo for this earth sign reading? So, um, Capricorn towards Virgo. I have the Two of Swords, the Page of Pentacles, the Tower, the Devil, and the Eight of Swords. I have um, Aquarius, Libra, Gemini, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo, Scorpio, Capricorn, and Aquarius, Libra, Gemini. Uh, Capricorn, Taurus, Virgo. I feel like you're indifferent about a situation or you don't want to face a situation. Or Capricorn towards Virgo, I feel like how you handle problems and issues, you either ignore them I heard bury. Like you bury the problems. You don't address them. And if the problems are addressed, they not handled according accordingly. Whatever this problem or issue is, somebody know like they have to face a problem. Possibly because I heard confrontation. Somebody don't want to deal with confrontation or they don't want to acknowledge a problem. Somebody don't have don't handle um situations maturely. Somebody's very childish with how they communicate or how they handle situations. That's why situations never be like resolved. It's always like a uh, some type of dis disruption. Yeah, it could be because somebody... I heard refusing to grow. I feel like somebody is refusing to grow. Refusing to handle their responsibilities. Somebody is still acting like a child. Behaving like a child. Another message I'm getting Capricorn towards Virgo, you could be having issues with your child. And you just don't, it's like you don't know what to do with this child. Your child could be always acting out, doing things they don't have no business doing. I feel like you're just tired of your child misbehaving. Or Capricorn towards Virgo, this could be this could be a family member or this could be a lover. It's like you're so tired of um this person's behavior to where it drives you crazy or it used to drive you crazy and now it's like you you want some shit like you know what? I, I don't even care anymore. I don't even care anymore. 
They can do whatever. I don't, I, I don't care. Another message, instead of somebody like addressing a problem or an issue, they revert back to negative behavior, negativity, addictions, gambling, drugs, sex, alcohol, lying, manipulating. And with... Uh, this eight of swords at the bottom of the deck. Uh, somebody could be like in a mental prison. I have the two of swords and the eight of swords at the bottom of the deck. Somebody could be having um like a mental breakdown or an emotional breakdown. Somebody is definitely in a, um, like in a, a mental prison. Somebody is definitely stuck in bondage, but I feel like that bondage is their mind. I have the emperor of the death. Okay, so yeah, somebody could be going through like a, a dark night of the soul. Death, re, death and transformation. I have one, two, three, four. I have four major arcanas out here. I feel like it's it's some type of shifts happening within a with the Capricorn towards Virgo. How they communicate, how they handle people, people, places, and things. It's very childlike. Somebody is childish as fuck. Or somebody is like refusing to grow up. Every time somebody refuses to go up and like handle their responsibilities, they just actually making it harder on themselves. But with this emperor card and death, somebody gonna I heard indecisive. Somebody gonna put a um an uh, end to being like indecisive and not being able to make decisions. Somebody's coming out of a mental conflict. I have the full nine of pentacles and the page of pentacles. Capricorn towards Virgo, you could be uh you could be going towards somebody too. You could be going towards a fellow Capricorn towards Virgo or Aries. Another message I'm getting, if you're going towards a person, because we are in Mercury retrograde, you could have been in your mind about like this person or this relationship. Or another message I'm giving you could be leaving a Cap a Capricorn towards Virgo, and you could have been in your mind about like, are you doing the right thing? Which direct direction should you take? If this has something to do with a relationship, um, you could have been indecisive on, do I go towards the person that I really want, or do I stay where I'm at? I heard old hag. Capricorn Toys Virgo, you could be with an old hag. Because I just heard. <laughs> um, I heard old hag. I don't know why that popped up in my, my head, but I heard that. Give me one second. Yeah, Capricorn towards Virgo. Yeah, you could be leaving an old hag. A old um well it could be a a old woman that dressed young. 
or a young woman that dress old or somebody act old whoever this is you you look at this person like an old hag or something whatever that mean yeah uh Capricorn towards Virgo I just see like confusion like you just confused you don't know what to do you don't know which direction to take you don't know if you should stay with an old hag or go towards someone else whoever this old hag is you know like you really don't trust them or you really don't like them or this person is not attracted to you attractive to you Another message I'm getting, you could be um, feeling like, why should you stay with, if this is a relationship, somebody on some shit, like, why should I stay with this person, and I just knew I did some shit behind their back. Whoever this is, this old hag, I feel like you did a lot of stuff behind their back. I, I feel like whoever this person is, they actually found out. Some of the stuff you did, but they don't know everything that you did behind this person's back. Uh, I do see growth out here. So, whoever this person, if this is a relationship, um, I feel like you questioning yourself. Like, why would I still be with this person and they don't even know the whole truth? Or I don't be completely honest with this person. Whoever's going through a transformation, it's like you want to start brand new. That's why this tower card is out here. You want to start over, start brand new. So, somebody is thinking like, how can I start brand new with this old hag? Or whoever you've been with, Capricorn towards Virgo. You feel like, how can you start new with this person when you could be still lying to them or still leading them on? I feel like you're still leading this person on and lying to them because you really don't know. I heard who to choose. You don't know who to choose or who to be with. But with this devil card, huh, let me see what else come out. Look, I have the emperor and the empress. Um, Capricorn towards Virgo. So this is the T. I feel like you're supposed to be with your counterpart. Because I have the Emperor and the Empress. I feel like you're supposed to be with your counterpart. But you left your counterpart to be with an old hag. I keep hearing old hag. Or if this is a man, this is a man that look old but dress young or dress young and act old or it's something weird with this person i feel like you turned your back on your counterpart to be with somebody else and you look at this person you don't look at this person as your equal or it's going to be revealed that this person is not you're equal. Somebody could look down on the person they with. Meanwhile, Capricorn towards Virgo, I feel like you have a lot of feelings. And I feel like you're in love with this Empress as well. Or Emperor. Because I do have... I do have a couple out here. The Emperor and the Empress. I feel like... The reason why y'all couldn't be together is because one person, like, made decisions to, like, go towards somebody else. Somebody tried to actually treat their counterpart um, like they were nothing or, or that their counterpart didn't mean nothing. 
but their counterpart is like everything you love this person you want to be with this person i heard bill you want to build with this person however i feel like y'all couldn't be together because you was still whoever i'm talking about they was still into like their childish ways immature ways somebody could have addictions drugs alcohol porn gambling lying misleading yeah because i heard lying and misleading and i do have the seven of swords out here i feel like that's why you couldn't be with your counterpart however with this old hag i feel like when you talk to this old hag um y'all have meaningless conversations y'all communication is childish It's something immature about this person you went towards. Act like a kid, behave like a kid. But I feel like your counterpart, your counterpart challenged you. But whoever you went to, that person, they don't, I feel like they don't challenge you. Somebody act like a little girl, even though like they old as fuck and look old as fuck. Or Capricorn towards Virgo, this is you. Another message I'm getting, you know that it's easier to be with this old hag. Somebody just feel like it'll be too difficult to actually be with their their counterpart. Another mess I'm getting, it's a lot of stuff that transpired or got in the way between you and your counterpart Capricorn towards Virgo. Somebody feel like they could have done better or they can find better than their actual counterpart. Uh, somebody actually found somebody that was worse. This person don't challenge them. Then somebody could have had like mental issues. I heard always up and down in their emotions. Somebody could have been having financial uh, issues too. Their money was always up and down. Then I feel like somebody was untrustworthy too. Somebody was always caught up in bullshit, drama. It's a lot of reasons why you and this person, your actual counterpart, could not be together. It's a lot of things that transpired. And I still feel like it's things that... I heard bitter left unsaid. With all these uh, major arcanas out here, if you do come back to your actual counterpart I feel like you're going to tell half truths I feel like you're going to leave stuff out somebody's not going to tell the whole truth when they come towards their actual counterpart but yeah that's all I have for this reading Capricorn towards Virgo thank you bye bye